very strong, willful people. Their story had been kept out of the press. It's really a series of tragedies. Right now, today, is still a very sensitive subject for the U.S. Navy. The story must get out. The naval tragedy that is the USS Indianapolis. Our ship was the flagship of Admiral Spruan. The captain was a great guy. There was tremendous guilt in my family putting Bill on that ship. Shipmates that survived had nightmares and still do. It was sent out on that top secret mission. The atomic bomb was a suicide mission, but if they make it, they'll be heroes. It was an unbelievable thing. They sunk us, you know. The ship blew up. guys incinerate. You could hear the bulkheads break. We still men down there screaming for their lives. And I was petrified. I tell the Lord, I don't want to die. Nobody knew we were sunk. They didn't even know where we were. But how could a ship like that go down and nobody know about it? Must have had 120, 150 sharks around us. Everybody on that ship was wounded. Within the hour, he's gone. You know, they wanted to know what happened. Why did civilian men die? They don't want to hear the truth. They were court-martialing the captain. I was devastated by these stories. You have to live with that. They just didn't want to accept the fact that the Navy would turn against their captain. How could the Navy allow it to happen? They were not telling them the truth. The stories and rumors. Jealousies. It was just a setup. It's a whitewash. It's a cover-up.